आज हम तो बोले बीएड थर्ड ईयर को यो मेजर इंग्लिश सब्जेक्ट क्रिटिकल रीडिंग्स इन इंग्लिश वाले यो सब्जेक्ट को लेसन थर्टी नाइन जस्ट माचे आ हाउ आई फॉरगेट इट वाले रा राय के सा इसको समझ लगाए तो क्या कोई सिनेमा चलो शेयर करना कोई रख चु यहाँ तो पहले ये नशा करने से यो चे अब चे यूनिट सेवन शुरू करेगा सा यो चे अंतिम यूनिट रहेगा सा वीट एंड ह्यूमर बने रहेगा सा रालेशन थर्टी नाइन में आ हाउ आई फॉरगेट इट भाईराब अरियल ट्रांसलेटेड बाय गोविंद राज बॉटराई बने रहेगा सा यो मतलब वाला चे पढ़ेरा मतलब वाला सुना नहीं सोए तब वाले स सटायरिस्ट इन नेपाली लिटरेचर हिज मेजर डोमेन अफ राइटिंग वाज सटायरिकल एंड ह्यूमरस एसेज इन हिज एसे हि रेकर्ड्स ह्यूमन विकनेस द मोडर्न मैन इज क्रस्ड बाय वेरियस फोर्सेस हि इज ओब्लिवियस टू एवरीथिंग एंड हि इज डिटर्ड ऑन द वे टू हिज एम्बिशन Ariel argues that forgetfulness has been a popular culture, culture and emits the rich people or some higher authority even for every simple request. It is believed that forgetfulness is one of the habits promoted together with man's promotion of designation. People give more value to money than brain power in the present the writer has compared the past time with present by introducing some western and eastern writers philosophers scientists musicians historian historians poet habit of memory and forgetfulness The story of forgetfulness dates back to even Einstein, Newton, Thomas, Alva Edison, and so on. They used to forget their names, dress, and food too. Similarly, P Nepalese great poet Lakshmi Prasad Devgupta used to ask the people repeatedly if he had to pay them. But there are some writers and religious masters who had a vigorous memory. Ariel introduces them in the in this essay. Lord Macaulay and Swami Vivekananda are some of them. The former used to write write the volumes without any book, and the latter used to lecture non-stop for hours. Nowadays, co-called called scholars or writers need dozens of books to write a simple article. Ariel satirizes the modern writers here. Ariel writes, "People feel proud of forgetting. It has been a kind of fashion as well. People tend to avoid the." their duties by uttering the phrase just forget it completely the writer condemns the religious scriptures which urge the people not to commit sin but do not mention one should not forget low ranking people also are learning to have learning the habit of forgetting from their bosses ariel suggests the audiences to read the biography of abraham lincoln julius caesar roosevelt and napoleon bonaparte who used to feel proud of being not forgetful he argues that there is no nexus between increment in workload and development of habit of forgetfulness furthermore ariel satirizes the modern poet and artist who claims themselves absent minded 
he rec recommends to read the early poets like Bias and Homer and Mozart Austrian musician to learn something about memory he valorizes the memory power of Bal Krishna Sam and Babram Acharya the above mentioned mentioned scholars had a strange memory power like a universe bank however our brain nowadays is like the beam of a mud house the present day intellectuals memory power is written in one part and in other other written by worms there are unnecessary things like a few coin a broken mirror mess boxes etc in the cracks of the beams here Ariel portrays the mind of present day intellectual as the rotten and warm eaten beam of the mud house moreover he argues that when the present day intellectual mind requires anything he or she does not know its whereabouts out nor, nor finds anywhere people nowadays are hit with a common disease that is forgetfulness people are suffering from the disease and feel extreme headache headache the disease leads the people to a state that is disorderliness Ariel satirizes the habit of forgetfulness as as arguing this is a more essential thing the people cannot forget their misdeeds grievances grievances being bankrupt and having misfortunes like being imprisoned actually people do not forget rather they pretend to be forgetting the things to avoid their duties Ariel concludes आयो चाहिँ समरी रहेको थियो मैले तपाईलाई चाहिँ शेयर गरे भने अब चाहिँ केही क्वेशन आन्सर रहेको छ यो म तपाईलाई चाहिँ शेयर गर्ने छु क्वेशन नम्बर 1 मा चाहिँ हाउ डज द अथर पोर्ट्रे द माइंड अफ द प्रेजेन्ट डे इन्टेलेक्चुअल्स इज इट जस्टिफाइएबल भने रहेको छ तपाईले यहाँ सम्म नोट गर्नुस् This is a question number two. Ma. Do you think that people nowadays have weaker memory than those of the past? Justify your answer. When you write that, then you have to write down. Hi, is my name. Two questions. Write down. Question answer. Aru. तपाईले लाइन पनि नोट गर्न सक्नुहुन्छ र नोट गरिसकेपछि तपाईले चाहिँ पहिला चाहिँ प्र्याक्टिस पनि तपाईले चाहिँ गर्नुहोस् आफ्नै तरिकाले तपाईले चाहिँ आन्सर लेख्ने कोसिस गर्नुहोस् पहिला सुरु पढेर आइडिया लिनुहोस् र त्यसपछि तपाईले आफ्नै तरिकाले आन्सर लेख्न सक्नुहुन्छ प्र्याक्टिस गर्न सक्नुहुन्छ हुन्छ आजलाई त्यति नै आउने समयमा अरु बाहेक रहेको लेसनहरुको पनि म तपाईलाई चाहिँ समरी लगायत केही क्वेशन आन्सरहरु शेयर गर्ने नै छु तब समय तब ले जी मेरे वीडियो ले जी लाइक कर दिनो ला शेयर कर दिनो ला और मेरे चैनल ला तब ले सब्सक्राइब करनो बाकी सही नो बने सब्सक्राइब पनी कर दिनो ला